to generally when I when I come in here. Yeah. <laughs> I first greet mom, see how she is, talk to her a bit. Oh, uh oh, she talks back. I have a little bit of a moment with her. Oh. And then after I've actually made the introduction again on a daily basis, I can get a bit closer to the cubs and start um, interacting with the cubs a bit too. And now comes one little cub on his own cord. Here we go. Here's the little one. And the eyes have just started to open. Not many people get to see cubs this size. Never mind interact with them. It's fantastic. Hello people. Hello everyone in the camera. Maybe it's feeding time. And uh, I don't want to overstay my welcome. So what I do is I come in, I interact, I bond a bit, bond with her. Um, the other thing that I'll do is I'll bring her cubs to her, show her that I'm not really hurting them. The way things basically work here is that when the lioness is pregnant, you know, we've got to isolate her from the pride. Like it would happen in the wild. And uh, allow her to have her cubs in peace and quiet. Um, if we don't, she'll have her cubs in the pride. And then the pride will have a field day at playing with them roughly or dropping them to part. Um, they're now five weeks old. When they get to eight weeks, they will be strong enough and robust enough to handle the big lions outside. I've got a picture of them all sleeping. That over there was the proud father. In another two weeks, you'll all be reunited. Here's your cubs, my boy. And look here the way he reacts to his cubs. Somehow, yeah, somehow I think he knows that. He knows who that is.